It's been a wild couple of days recently with us casually hopping on a plane to Ireland for my cousin's beautiful wedding. Unfortunately, not everything went to plan. Okay, so we missed a flight. Right? Um, I can't really talk about it too much, but I'm just a bit... I uh, can't believe this happened. My mum... We're gonna see if the plane can arrange, the company can arrange another flight. Um, our luggage is on, on the flight. Um, we don't even know if there's another one going out to Belfast today. So, literally, we're up the creek at the moment. I think we just gotta wait to see what. What do they say? They're gonna come and talk to us? Yeah, the, what, what, what hap, what's happening, babe? What's the drill? They're going to come get us. And how long is it going to take? Very nice. Guys, I'm in the um, lounge. Have you known? I'm kind of glad that we got delayed secretly because they have so much um, perks in the, in the lounge. Food. They have, um, you know, spa, complimentary wine, things like that. So, yeah, um, we're chilling in there. I can't really show you around. I might be able to take a few snapshots um, while no one's looking, but I think people just want their privacy. So. into our Airbnb now. If you use our Airbnb, let me know. Let me know how it worked out for you guys. Uh, we'll let you see more when we get inside. So this is our, um, this is where we're staying for the next couple of days. Just shut this door. Yeah. And uh, this is room one. Never been in an Airbnb before. Actually quite nice. Oh, let's go through here. This is bedroom number two. This is really nice. Like I I'm I'm good. <laughs> I'm actually good for the next two days. Oh, and uh, uh, what's in here? Oh, this is nice. Oh, this is really nice. Uh, nice and small, but just enough, just enough. I don't know what we're gonna do in terms of a bar, for little man, but this is the kitchen. This is lovely. This is really nice. Good size and basically everything you need. Um, Got like a little list there. I don't know what it says, but you could do this. Um, you could do this. and uh, what's the crack? I can't do Irish. I'll try. Top of the morning to you. Top of the morning. <laughs> My husband's going no. Shut up. Don't embarrass me. I'm here. Uh, this is really nice. This is really nice. Keeps going out of focus, this camera. It is really nice of him. And then they've done this little uh, thing on here. It's just so nice. Um, I'm gobsmacked. Gobsmacked. Got some books in here. So yeah, this is us for the rest of the evening. We'll see you in the morning.
we are on our way back to the reception. I've never been to a, a Catholic wedding before. Um, very poignant, um, very heartfelt. But I can see my cousin um, absolutely loves his wife. And, um, so yeah, it was quite poignant. And you know, I was really glad to see like my family and they're absolutely nuts. There's a point in the wedding where they all burst out singing and start singing, oh, happy day. <laughs> Sorry, my family just as nuts as me, actually, maybe a little bit more. <laughs> but um, yeah, so um, that was nice. They sang, oh, happy day. And they're singing from the crowd, actually. Uh, she gave a bit of life. Cheryl, Cheryl, my cousin. Oh my gosh, she like. I think I don't know why she's not famous already. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie, cause she can sing, and she had my even my son. He's only two, and he was just looking at her like, wow. So um, yeah, we're heading off to the reception. Yeah, my mum just come off the phone. She's being vain now, brushing her hair, and Ez is just jamming. <laughs> Um, I'm just going to spend some time with it. What a beautiful bride and what a beautiful wedding. I'm so proud of my cousin for just keeping his head in the grind and making a great life for himself out in Ireland. I mean, we had an absolute blast. The views, the family, the laughter and the wedding blew us all away. We are definitely coming back for our Game of Thrones tour and to catch up with our Irish family. There are so many beautiful memories to look back on. To be honest, I'm hating the fact that I have to sign out from this vlog because it's so poignant for me. But until next time, slan lat. Goodbye.